Hi, welcome to Kairos House. Today we've got for you a review, actually, on these. The Grip Grab Overshoe uh, with no zip. Um, as you can see, no zip on the back, no zip there, no zip there, just a hole in the bottom. So, um, I got these. Oh, let's just pull that out. Just close that back up in there. Um, got these because I was fed up with zips and water coming down in my foot. Um, I'll go on to why that's bubbled up in a little bit. Um, okay, so these are quite unique in the fact that you put your foot in, put your foot in, you pull it up over your, pull it up your leg like this, put your shoe on and then pull it down over your shoe. I've actually got one here and um, that's fitted on my shoe. Okay, it's a bit difficult to see at this angle, but um, as you know, I've got the Bunt Riot Road. Um, it's actually really tough to get on. Um, they, as you can see, I'll just bring in this one. If we put the shoe down, you can see they're quite a bit smaller than the shoe, yeah. They do stretch, which is good, and that may be adding to the fact that these are starting to lift. Um, but, as you can see, uh, this is like a sticky rubber material. It almost makes a seal on the bottom of your shoe, so the water can't penetrate. Um, this is obviously to, uh, that's rubberized grip as well. That's got like a rubber finish on it. That's grippy. That's the toe, uh, toe abrasion bit there. They come in black as well. They're not just in high vis. Um, they're very, they're, they're really warm actually. It takes a while for your toes to warm up. I wore them out in the cold the other day. Um, they haven't worn them in the rain yet. I just bought them primarily to keep my toes warm because I am um, I'm a big sufferer with cold feet. So uh, it's three mil neoprene. Um, I'd recommend these. These are good. Nice and warm, nice and toasty. Um, I went for a ride without them uh, just a few days ago. Feet were so cold. Um, so I think I'm going to ride with these or maybe some uh, some other toe thingies if it's not that cold. But when it's really cold, I'm going to go for these. These are brilliant. No zip um, and they hug the shoe. If I can, I'll try and put one on camera. Um, but um, they are worth the money. I'm not sure how much they are. I'll leave a link in the description below. There's obviously a high vis bit there. Oh, sorry, reflective, and the reflectors on the side. On this one, they're starting to come off. I'm not sure whether that's uh, just because I've left them in the in the conservatory and they've got hot. But that I think they're all starting to lift on this side, uh, which. Might not be a bad thing, I'm not going to ride with them in the dark, so. Um, so let's try and put this one on. So, obviously, you go to put your shoe on, and then you just pull them down the outside. So, we we'll put the heel in. As you can see, it's quite a bit shorter, so you're just going to have to stretch it. So, heel in, give it a big stretch. Don't know if it'll work one-handed. It's easier when you've got your feet in the boots, let me tell you. So they just fit over the top, as you can see. That's not bad. So I've actually done it. I'm quite impressed with myself. And that velcro is on there to stop them coming off. Obviously, if we'd have had our foot in there, it would be easier. So there, that's how they go on. They stretch over, nice and aero. Yeah. Obviously, we haven't got it in the middle, but um, it's not too bad. Um, I'm going to recommend these, even though the reflectors are starting to lift off. Yeah, um, 
it doesn't take anything away from the from the uh, heat properties. Um, I think it's actually my fault that the reflectors are peeling off on this side. But um, that's just a quick review on these. Again, they come in black. I got them from Wiggle. I'm not sponsored by Wiggle, but that's just where I get my stuff. So, uh, grip grab, uh, zipless overshear for the cold weather. Brilliant. I'm highly recommending it. Um, I've got no issues with them at all. Get, um, getting them on is a bit weird if you, uh, for the first time. Um, you think they're too small, but they're not. Um, they're brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. And that's the end of my review. Right then, let's just get these weighed. And um, we'll just centre that. I'll just put them one at a time on here. So we're looking at 106 grams, 106 grams for both. Two fourteen, it says. 214 for both. So not that heavy. Worth all the money. Well they're not they're not that expensive, but worth all the money you're paying for them. So let's bring those both in. Grip grab zipless overshoe. Fantastic. Gets a thumbs up from Cairo's house. Like subscribe. And um, see you on the next video. Take care. Bye.